Just turn the clouds off. You full screen, you can go to window mode like I have, or you can go full screen. I don't think that makes much of a difference. What's happening guys? My name is Alex. Welcome to a new video and this is the first OBS tutorial of the day and in this video I'm going to show you guys the best settings you need to know to record in you know Minecraft in standard quality HD. So I'm going to run through all the settings you need to know to actually make it look really good in HD and everything around it. So I would say let's jump straight into the actual video. Okay everyone, so as you guys can see we are in OBS and the first thing you want to do is you want to boot up Minecraft first. So I'm going to start up Minecraft and I'll see you guys when that is done. A few more moments later all right guys so i booted up minecraft and basically the first thing that you want to do actually to the best settings is you want to, we were going to go back to obs for a second okay so we were back on obs and basically what the first thing that you want to do is i'm going to click on settings and i'm click on settings again i'm going to go straight to the encoding tab so as you guys can see this is my encoding tab this is what i filled in a lot of people ask like yo what is what are the right settings and how can i do this and what do i need well actually guys it depends on what kind of system you have i have like an 1100 dollar pc a i7 processor 16 gig 16 gigabytes of ram amd radeon 2 gigabyte graphics card so there is a difference between my computer and some other computers from subscribers i don't know guys if my settings don't work for you please don't write in the comments like yo your settings doesn't work for me well basically it really depends on what kind of system you have like you want to you know mess around with the max bit rate and the buffer size and a lot of people ask me like dude what is the best settings for my pc and like dude i don't know what kind of pc you have it's like the same like how much does a car cost like what do you mean what car what type so basically i cannot know like what computer you have because they say like dude what are the best settings for my computer or i can ask the same thing like yo what's the price of a bag of groceries like what's in the grocery what in the, what is in the bag if you guys try to you know what i'm trying to say i have no idea what you guys you know your pc specs are so make sure to start at 5000 do some rec do some recordings and if it lags please don't write in the comments like yo the settings don't work because this is for my computer basically what you want to do is you want to also keep them on the same levels so do not like type in 5000 and 4000 you just want to type in 4000 4000 3500 3500 so you also when you want to keep that you know both the same and I would say keep lowering the settings until you have actually nice quality without any lags. So make sure to drop the quality, you know, I mean drop the bit rate and the buffer size from 5000 to, I don't know, like a thousand. I don't know what works. For, I don't know what works best for you guys. So you just want to fill in. As you can see, I have, I have five thousand. It depends on what kind of system you have. And if you know, like, okay, this, this, okay, this is lagging. I'm going to go four thousand. It also lags a bit. Go to three thousand. And if you find everything that makes less lag in OBS, actually, that's basically you're set on that part. So let's say you have everything done in OBS and you are ready to record but you also want to have like your your Minecraft settings optimized as well. You don't need up to fine for this. I mean, if you know for recording you you can choose your graphics card, your microphone and all that. So once you've done that, I'm going you want to go back to your Minecraft. So now that we're back on Minecraft, we're going to go to options and you want to click on video settings. And here you want to um, fill in a few like copy a few things because those are the settings that make less, you know, lag or less memory or less heavy. So first of all, the graphics, you want to put that on fan I don't know. I don't. I don't know why you should uh, put it on fast. I just have it on fancy. It works great. The smooth lighting is just off. This 3D one also off. You know, the GUI scale is you want the normal because that's like how far you can see. The clouds, you can choose that. I don't know. I just turn it off just to make sure that like I have the less lag. I just turn the clouds off. You full screen. You can go to window mode like I have, or you can go full screen. I don't think. I don't think that makes much of a difference. And then uh, use the VBOs. So you want to keep that off. And then right here, guys, your render distance is basically the second, you know, important thing of all. So chunks are in Minecraft how far you're gonna you're gonna see. So if you put this one to 32 chunks, you can see like a lot. But if you put it one like on on six or eight, you just wanna you're probably going to you know maximum like I don't know like 20 feet instead of like so many further. So I would say you don't need to what you don't need to view that far. So what I would say is keep you know the chunks on about. 15 to 20 i'm going to put this one on 15 that works perfect as you can see and then the, the max frame rate guys a lot of people say i'm going to record minecraft in 30 fps i'm going to put it this way well i mean i'm going to record minecraft in 50 fps um, or like 60 fps or 120 fps well guys to make sure that you know put this frame rate on unlimited 
because you will give your graphics card the freedom to choose the frame rate that works best. If you're going to lock it down to a certain, get you know, FPS, it might lag or get stuck. So you just want to put this one on unlimited. So that is basically the, you know, the most important thing about those settings. The view bubbling, I have to, I just have that on on. The brightness is just plus 26 for me. Particles is all the use. V-Sync is off. Alternate blocks is off. And entity shadows are also on. So those are actually the best settings to record Minecraft. I know guys, it's not difficult at all. And as you guys can see, that is basically what you need. So now you can go ahead and start recording Minecraft. So I'm going to join a, a random server real quick. So I'm going to go and let's say Hypixel. And there shouldn't be, you know, a lot of lag actually, as you guys can see. It, it, it goes it goes it goes pretty smooth as you can see i don't know guys that is basically how you get the best settings so that is that's the same with this guys there's nothing more to tell you guys so just want to optimize those settings and if this video went by too fast guys make sure to, to pause and rewind this video i would say that's basically the video so that was a video guys it's really simple that is how that's those are the best settings for minecraft so i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to smash the like button down below also make sure to smash the subscribe button down below for more videos so i want to thank you guys for watching thank you guys for the, for the continued support i'll see you guys in two hours for not obs tutorial but i'm an, but an unboxing of a really nice piece of equipment that I bought, you know, from donations. So you guys will all see that. Make sure to check out my channel in about two hours from now. And I will see you guys in a bit. I'm going to give you guys six tips for beginner drivers. My name's LDHH Official. As yeah. always. Yeah. And I upload one video every day of the week. Except on Saturday and Sunday. I'm just going to start streaming live. First question for today. Ooh. So that's going to be through this hall. It's going to be pretty dark. So we have the door. Future your calendar, your question. And I'll see you guys in the next video.